So when we talk about high tracheostomia students, there is only one indication that is a supraglottic malignancy presenting with strider. So when we have to do a definitive laryngectomy in such patients, this is the only indication to do a high tracheostomy. So what is high tracheostomy? You do that is you take out the first tracheal ring. When you have to do a high tracheostomy, it becomes very easy to do a laryngectomy at a lower level later on. So what are the complications of doing a high tracheostomy? If a high tracheostomy is done, the most important complication is a subglottic stenosis. Hence, in patients who have malignancy coming with strider, you do a high tracheostomy, it is very easy to do a laryngectomy and do a permanent stoma at a lower level. When we talk about mid tracheostomy, it is usually done at the second and the third tracheal ring and that is the most common type of tracheostomy. When we talk about a low tracheostomy, it is done at the fourth tracheal ring or lower down. The most important complication there is a innominate artery injury.